We had the second order linear and homogeneous other differential equation and two initial conditions. And we're going to start with writing characteristic equation, which is r squared plus 2r and plus 2 equals to 0. Now we're going to use the quadratic formula to find the root. So r equals to negative 2 plus or minus square root of 2 squared minus 4 times 1 times 2 and divided by 2 times 1 so we get that r equals to negative 2 plus or minus square root of negative 4 and over 2 therefore our roots are negative 1 plus or minus i so we have two different complex roots to form alpha plus or minus beta i therefore the general solution of the given differential equation is going to be of the form um, e to the power of alpha t times c sub 1 times cosine of beta t plus c sub 2 times sine of beta t. Therefore, our general solution is e to the power of negative t times c1 times cosine t plus c sub 2 times sine t. Now we're going to differentiate our solution and we get negative e to the negative t times c1 times cosine t plus c sub 2 times sine t plus e to the negative t times negative c1 times sine t plus c sub 2 times cosine and now we're going to use initial conditions at y of p of pi over 4 equals and we substitute t with pi over 4 so we get e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c, c1 times cosine of pi over 4 plus c sub 2 times sine of pi over 4 so we know that y of pi over 4 equals 2 and on the right hand side we have e to the power of pi over 4 times c sub 1 times 1 over the square root of 2 plus c sub 2 times 1 over the square root of 2 therefore we get 2 equals to e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c sub 1 over square root, two, square root of 2 and plus e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c sub 2 and over square root of 2 and now we're going to use a second condition that's y prime of pi over 4 equals and we substitute in this equation t with pi over 4 that's going to be negative e to the negative pi over 4 times c sub 1 times cosine of pi over 4 plus c sub 2 times sine of pi over 4 and plus plus e to the power of negative pi over 4 times negative c1 times sine <coughs> sine of pi over 4 plus c sub 2 times cosine of pi over 4 so we know that the root of, of y with, of pi over 4 equals to negative 2 and on the right hand side we have negative e to the negative pi over 4 times c sub 1 over square root of 2 minus e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c sub 2 over square root of over 2 minus e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c sub 1 over square root of 2 and plus e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c sub 2 over square root of 2 so we get that negative 2 negative 2 equals to negative e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c1 and over square root of 2.
So we multiply uh, both sides by square root of 2 over negative e to the negative power of 4 and we get that, that c1 equals to negative 2 square root of 2 over e negative e to the power of negative pi over 4 and now we're gonna find c sub 2 and we put this value and um, in our equation and we get that 2 equals to e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c sub 1 which is negative 2 square root of 2 over negative e to the power of negative pi over 4 and divided by square root of 2 plus e to the power of negative pi over 4 times c sub 2 over square root of 2 so we get the 2 equals um, here we're gonna get 2 plus c sub 2 times e to the power of negative pi over 4 and over square root of 2 uh, therefore we get that c sub 2 equals to 0 now we substitute these values in our general solution to get that our general solution is is 2 square root of 2 e to the power of negative t and over e to the power of negative pi over 4. So that's our answer.